Hello there, internet dwellers. Welcome back to another subreddit review. Reddit review. Completely new and original content. Some of you were asking me to do adverts again, react to strange adverts or, you know, PSAs and stuff like that. So I thought this is probably the next best thing to that. This subreddit is called Where Did The Soda Go? It's got 1 million subscribers and I'll explain to you now what this subreddit is about. A subreddit for infomercials taken out of context in animated images. This subreddit is for ads that show real aspects of life but in a completely unrealistic way. So basically, they're they're showing adverts that already exist but they're misleading them in the title if you know what i mean they're they're they make you think what the hell is going on right now it's basically like a cursed video just taken out of context completely i guess the difference between this and that is there is no context in a cursed video whereas this there is context but it's been completely taken away so without context it just looks stupid so i'll put it to the top of the past year as i usually do and we're going to jump straight into this so here we go this top one is is your dumb kid sad because nobody bullies them effing glue some paint to their head here we go oh all sad lonely there we go um why is that a good idea that must be very uncomfortable in the hair how do you get that out i would like to see a graph for how much hair loss is then uh, produced after you know inserting this what is going on with my speech i feel like i'm having a mini stroke right now the worst thing about identity thieves is how stealthy they are <laughs> what protect your identity from thieves what's it what's he trying to do Trying to take a picture of his license plate. Dude, just wait for him to get into the car, you stupid idiot. I mean, he must have level 100 stealth on Oblivion because no, there's no other way that this guy doesn't detect him. But um, just wait for him to get in the car, dude. I don't, I don't understand what you're trying to do. As Laura began to use her new toy, she hoped it would be big enough to finally give her pleasure she'd so desperately desired. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, I mean, how does that look good in any kind of way? <laughs> what were they going for with this advert? What does that do? Are you fat? Bet you never tried rotating clockwise, huh, dummy? Just three weeks. And there we that's all you need to do, guys. If you're, if you're unhappy with your body, just simply do a twist clockwise. It has to be clockwise. Because if you go anti-clockwise, you actually get bigger. There you go. You are a ripped specimen or you are the most toned specimen to exist. That's all it takes, guys. Frank was a career criminal looking for an easy target. It wasn't until he felt the wind on his head that he was reminded of his sudden hair loss. <laughs> and now we'll reveal the name of the murderer. Gasp. It's Patrick. What? Jamie, <laughs> it's Patrick. This kid can't read, bless him. Come on, this isn't a laughing matter, he can't read. Come on, we need to get this kid some education, for God's sake. Stop saying the police in America are biased. Here's the video proof that they, are, they go after all colors. What? Color selector, black, 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 or black. I mean, there's a lot of options to choose from there, to be fair. I mean, um, I might just go for the black one, but then again, the black one sounds good as well. What's the point in showing on screen what colors it comes with if there's only one bloody color? That's like me making a ruler that says, okay, if you want this ruler, we got it in 30 centimeters, 30 centimeters, or 30 centimeters. How to politely refuse someone offering you a diet soda? I guess uh, that's the one way of doing it. You karate each other. That was so blatant. That was so blatant that she wanted to knock that over. No, you don't. You don't do this. What? You don't go up to it, and you don't do this. Usually, when you knock something over, you're in. You're going in that direction to pick something up, and you didn't. You forgot that there's something there. You don't rotate your hand like this. You don't go down like this. What kind of thing were you? What kind of thing were you suggesting? Were you saying? This is what a horseshoe looks like. Jennifer's tasteful use of blackface wasn't appreciated at work, but she knew no one could judge her at home. <laughs> That's terrible. 
That's awful. God, context really is something that's needed in this society. Without context, you could get into a heap load of trouble. But even then, even with context, people try and take context out of context. That's why political correctness is killing comedy right now. Although there was context in a joke, most people take the bit that there is no context in. They just take the bit that runs up to the punchline. Hell yeah, that's my jam. <laughs> I told you to stay away from my husband, bitch. <laughs> that looks like human hair. What the hell we, have you been doing? Is someone's head stuck in this hoover? Thanks to AT&T and Comcast lobbying to destroy internet freedoms, Mary couldn't afford Netflix anymore and had to watch boring ass local news. <laughs> what are these infomercials, man? These are freaking terrible. Barbara had a craving for McDonald's barbecue sauce and she knew just where to find it. Oh, what the hell? Like I said, guys, without context, this is just terrible. She's that, uh, 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 that, it just, yeah, it makes me feel weird. Hey, Vsauce Michael here. This guy's D is tiny, or is it? <laughs> After stepping on Lego for years, John decided it was time to take it to the next level. Oh my god. Hang on. What kind of maniac? I mean, even if you drop loads of pins on the floor, most of them go to the side and only a few of them stick up. The fact that someone, someone's put those there as someone's just put those there facing upright and they've not only done like a couple, they've done about 50. Well, this guy is either sadistic as hal and loves pain or there's someone out there trying to kill him i would uh, i would watch out dude who you let into your house it's definitely the cat i'm just saying susan couldn't ignore the voices any longer what the hell what is that promoting that's terrifying. That's like something from Welcome to the Game. It's like something you find on the dark web. Oh, I know what it probably is. It's probably a facial massager, right? Where you put it on, there's probably some kind of like things on the inside that vibrate your face. Imagine walking into the lounge, bottle of wine there, for no bottle of wine, a glass of wine there. Honey, how was your day? Oh my God, and you just see him turn around. Like, I've been expecting you, stroking the cat with wine somehow i don't know i remember when i was younger my mum used to work very very early at a cleaning job and my dad knew she worked early so he basically got his guitar right wrapped a coat around it zipped it up and on the head of the guitar he put a mask like this but it was one of those white ones where it is like proper psychopathic mask and uh we all woke up to a blood curdling scream that morning it wasn't it wasn't very nice it's never nice to wake up to a blood curdling scream susan was on her first date after the divorce she f unfortunately didn't understand her friend's advice to shake her goods to impress her date god those are some bingo wings right there aren't they jesus she could take off with those if she was to jump off of a freaking like high building she would have one of those like you know one of those flying suits she, she'd be fine it'll just like capture just into there and she'll be able to glide down to safety that was really mean ryan come on stop it we're all gonna get old one day not only will tesla's next gen car cook your breakfast it will also quickly and painfully teleport you to your destination <laughs> just cock a window open turn the aircon on forgot why are you frying eggs on your dashboard you crazy bitch imagine walking past that commercial and just seeing sort of like excuse me what are you doing in that car we're just <clears throat> i'm just cracking an egg to show the heat just turn the aircon on yeah but, but then it won't we're trying to sell a product here what are you trying to sell aircon yeah okay what what was that <laughs> <laughs> so where do I get it from? Oh, you just go onto our website. But we've already got aircon in our car, so what's the point in getting more aircon? Just stop. Go away, will you? Okay, let's stop now. Greg was not called back to play athletic businessman ever again. <laughs> if I was that guy, can we reshoot that, please? Can we just... I, I want to make myself look a little bit cooler. Sorry, Greg. We're working with uh, one shot budget right now so that's it but i've got this condom hanging out hanging out my bum where did that come from i have to be honest the new disney cinderella movie looks pretty lame <laughs> a 
like, what? Why do commercials do this? Listen, ladies, there's nothing wrong with wearing joggers and like a, just a loose top, okay? You don't, why would you wear your best dress to clean the house with? That is the most illogical thing you could do. And uh, you know what? Let's just, let's just move on. Scientists have identified a chemical found in popcorn that makes you remember that embarrassing thing you did that one time. <laughs> I farted in an exam. I can't believe it. I thought no one would hear, but I had a headphones on. Everyone heard. That didn't happen to me. I didn't take a bat. It happened to Ryan. <laughs> Are the kids bored? Do you want to keep them happy for hours on end? Babysitting just got a lot easier thanks to shrooms for kids. Watch as the kids can now see, feel, and taste colours. This... <laughs> You know, <laughs> you know what this reminds me of? That bounce by the ounce. <laughs> you could easily transition from this to bounce by the ounce with that guy you're going like gurning like mad. <laughs> anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more Reddit Reviews. I'm never doing that again. That's the second time and last time I'm doing that. I apologize profusely. PewDiePie, please don't copyright strike me. If you want to see more, subscribe, like. I'm aiming for 200,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So any help towards that is appreciated. Mr. Beast, just come at me, mate. That'll be that'll be fantastic. Thank you very much. Take care, guys. Praise the men. Jesus. Hello. What's going on? Who are you? <laughs>